We're here with uh, Ely Anku, who uh, made his first day here at practice. Ely, talk about being here on your first day, what that was like for you. Um, it was great. Um, you know, got in yesterday, uh, flew in, trying to get, you know, acclimated to everything. Uh, as far as plays, I, I, I'm a blank slate. I'm just, you know, coming in, trying to be physical, and uh, just trying to get better every day. So. Talk about uh, the process of shedding the gray shirt. And then when Coach Moore called you, what was that like for you? Talk about the excitement, if there was one. Um, I was surprised, but I was definitely, definitely excited. Uh, that was one thing I really wanted to do is come in early, you know, show the coaches what I'm capable of. Uh, capable of. So um, I'm really excited about that. Just going to put in the work and do what I can to help out. So. When you're a gray shirt, do, uh, Coach Moore said that they don't monitor your conditioning, but seeing you, obviously, you've kept up with that conditioning. Yes. Um, talk about that regimen, what you go through. Did you, as you reg, ratchet up a, a couple more notches uh, as you wore a gray shirt, or was it the same for you? As soon as I heard the word gray shirt, it was all boosters on. It was just turbo it up and uh, just work out. Um, I was doing, for a lot of weeks, I was doing you know, five days a week. Uh, I was doing uh, a lot of squats, a lot of leg power. Um, my coach definitely helped me out with that speed, uh, agility, <laughs> just working up and uh, just trying to get physically stronger, faster. Can you talk about some of your maxes? As you mentioned squatting, how much would you max? Uh, squat, well, I did my front squat max. Uh, I ended up doing 380, 380, 390, around that area. Um, bench press max was 375. Uh, back squat, I haven't done it yet. I didn't have the time. <laughs> um, clean. I did was 280, 280. And so it was fair, fair numbers. Could get better though. Right. Could get better. Do, were you back home? Were you here in California? I was back home in Ottawa. Uh, I was training with Victor Tedondo. He's uh, he's running an academy over there, so he helped me out a lot. Um, just get a stronger, faster. So. Was logistically was did you have to, was there a lot of paperwork that had to be cleared before you could come or oh yeah I mean seeing as I'm an international student you know you have a lot of paperwork to take care of uh, you got your I-20 you know everything just to put in one bunch you know coming in from another country is definitely harder I mean as far as paperwork but I everything got cleared up so uh, where do you figure to be in the rotation do you think you'll, you'll see some playing time on the field anytime this year or right now I wouldn't be able to tell you um, I'm not exactly sure uh, what the coaches are, are seeing me as right now. Uh, first day again, uh, but definitely in the next couple of weeks I'll find out myself, see where I fit in. So, are you excited that you know the first game that you'll be in it will uh, be a home I, I game will, with those? I will be dressed. Um, we'll see about playing time. I, as I said, I'm a blank slate. I got it here. So, sounds good. Thanks, Gilly.